Hello everyone, so welcome to this video. I am Mayank Agarwal and in this video, I'm going to walk you on what all you can expect in the upcoming batch which we are launching, full stack data science. So in this course, again, we are going to start from complete scratch and make sure that we are able to make you a master in data science field. So now let us deep dive into the syllabus and the curriculum of this particular course. In this course, we are going to start from complete scratch and make sure that you understand Python first. Because as all of you are aware, Python is the language of choice for doing machine learning, data science, as well as the state of the art here. In Python, we are going to cover the most basic topic so that if anyone is starting from complete scratch or is a college student, he can also understand the same. We are going to start with variables as well as cover the advanced OOP concept so that you can make a project from end to end. Once Python is done, then we are going to start with data science. In the data science, we have to make sure that our math concepts are well revised and clear. For the same, we will make sure that before starting any particular module, we are covering each and everything which will be required for you. Based on my experience of working at OYO Rooms, Goldman Sachs, as well as Mindtickle, I have made it clear that all the things will be a lot supported by projects and the projects will also be industry grade so that you have a stellar CV once you complete this course. So once we start with data science, we are going to make sure that we cover statistics and probability in great depth and then move on to hypothesis testing and EDA and other topics. Everything will be supplemented with good projects which you can add to your CV. Moving forward, we are going to start with machine learning. The base which we created in data science will be a lot helpful to start and actually understand machine learning algorithms from scratch. In machine learning, each and every algorithm will be explained to you very nicely with proper intuition as well as the derivation. The same is actually important when you give interviews and I personally have also taken many interviews where student faces issue in the same. After that, once that all is explained, we will move forward on understanding each and every algorithm in supervised as well as unsupervised machine learning. Once we complete machine learning, we are also going to cover topics like anomaly detection and dimensionality reduction as they are a lot helpful in projects. Now, before starting with deep learning, we make sure that we do five to seven industry grade projects, which can help you to make sure understand your topics clearly. These topics are going to help you to understand everything which we have done theoretically as well as reinforce your learning. Next, we will move on to deep learning. Now in deep learning, we are going to first make sure that we clear your intuition as well as the full explanation behind neural networks. In neural networks, we are going to see different libraries like TensorFlow, Keras, as well as PyTorch. As in industry today, all of these are expected from a candidate. Now, once the basics of deep learning are clear, we are going to do some projects and then move on to advanced topics like CNN, image segmentation, and some algorithms like YOLO. We have to make sure that everything here is a lot clear as it is getting used in industry. In respect with the same, we are going to also study about computer vision and different projects which you can make, which are very awesome. Now, once deep learning is completed, then we are going to move to NLP. Now, natural language processing is actually a lot important, especially with the advent of large language models in today's world. Each of your models like ChatGPT, Claude, and even Gemini Pro all uses LLM and NLP concepts in the backend. So we want to make sure that we complete this thing very nicely and then start with our introduction to Gen AI. Gen AI, as you all are aware, is a lot important field in today's world and everyone is actually looking for a Gen AI developer. Now in Gen AI, we will start with introduction to all the large language models as well as explaining you everything about the language. Of course, everything will be supplemented by projects so that all your learning is actually getting tested. Now once all this is done, then we have also introduced big data in this code. Now big data, of course, is a lot important as all the companies are generating large amounts of data and technologies which are sophisticated in handling those data like Hadoop, Spark, are required by each and every company. Now, after doing all this and doing 15 plus projects, your CV will actually be a lot great and you will be good for any job. But we have also made sure that we include all the tips as well as tricks which can help you in clearing your interview. Based on my extensive experience as well as mentoring experience on mentoring at different platforms, as well as working at OYO and Goldman Sachs, I have made sure that all the tips and secrets which companies look forward to hire in a candidate, that all are shared and presented to you so that you can ace your next interview. The course is going to start next month from 8 July and classes will be held from 7 to 10 on Tuesdays, Thursdays and Saturdays. So what are you waiting for? Enroll yourself right now and check the links in the comment of the course. Or if you are still confused, talk to a counselor and he will help you to make sure that every of your question is answered and I will see you in the course.